What's up guys, Matt Beck here from freesaloneducation.com. Today, I've got two trends for you guys. The first one's going to be a blunt bob haircut. I'm gonna walk you guys through that step-by-step, -step, showing you exactly how to do it. But also, I wanted to uh, add in a coppery tone that they're saying is trending for early 2022. So, Paul Mitchell sent me their Cover Smart uh, Color XG. This is what it looks like. Paul Mitchell Color XG Cover Smart features 10 new shades of durable 100% gray resistant and white hair coverage. What do they mean by durable? Basically, uh, all of these shades are gonna fade on tone. Fading on tone is so important because we all know that hair color does fade, but you want it to fade to a nice tone. You don't want it to fade to something crazy. So I hope you guys enjoy the hair color, the cut that goes with it. I'm gonna walk you guys through the cut right now. Uh, so let me know what you think. Would you wear this hair color? Let's hang out in the comments. Let's talk about what's going on, ask questions, get to know each other. Let's build this community bigger, guys. Let's get started. Here we go. All right, guys, so I'm going to start off this technique by splitting the head in half, basically creating a center parting straight down uh, the center and then straight down center back, comb everything off to the side. If your guest has a side parting, then you're just going to base it off of their natural part. So make sure you figure that out where they're comfortable wearing their hair before you proceed with the next steps. And then the cut angle that I'm going to be creating is going to be following the jawline. So a uh, cool little graphic here to showcase that I want that angle to mimic. So the parting that I just took is mimicking that jawline. And then I'm going to do the same thing with my cut line. It'll run parallel to the parting. So everything is based off of uh, a facial feature. It's not just going in there and freehand cutting. I want this to really flow with the, the face shape. So um, I'm going to work side to side. So I cut the left side. Uh, I cut the right side first. Then I go in and I cut the left side and then I clean up my line and then I continue through. I'll go through now and cut the left side. My guideline is going to come from underneath. So another key factor here is to make sure that I'm not holding tension in the hair. What do I mean by that? I'm not pulling it tight with my fingers. I comb it down to natural fall. I may hold it with the comb just to hold it in place, but with no tension, because if you pull it tight with your fingers, what you're gonna do is you're gonna stretch out the hair in certain places. There's a lot of flexibility in the scalp. Uh, and then what happens is you release that and then you get a crooked line in the hair because that tension is pulling all over the place. So make sure that you just comb the hair down to natural fall and you cut it. That makes this haircut super simple. Uh, if you guys are following along and you think it's simple, type simple in the comments because uh, you know I just wanna see that you guys are following and understanding it. And here's another little key factor. Notice the arrow that I just posted on there. Um, this is the direction that you're cutting. So I'm cutting, if I'm going to the right, my scissor is facing pointing to the right and I move to the right. If I'm cutting to the left, my scissors facing pointing to the left and moving in that direction. Why do I wanna do it consistent like that on both sides? It's because anytime you cut with a scissor, you're gonna have a slight push of the hair. You want the hair pushing the same on both sides. I'm also cutting a down angle following that jawline. And if I'm cutting up, kind of like forcing against the current, I'm going to be cutting hair shorter than I wanted to. So stay consistent on both sides and you'll get a consistent result at the end of this haircut. So now I'm just gonna continue through this in the wet cut, doing the exact same thing. Uh, we'll turn up the music a little bit, guys. See what you think. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Let me know in the comments what you think of it. Uh, here it is. All right, guys, so now I've finished up my wet cut. You can see that line following right along with the jawline. And now I'm going to mix up, put a little product in. This is Paul Mitchell Neuro Lift. I hope you guys like that graphic. This is a great foam product. Um, it's one of my favorite categories within Paul Mitchell. It's a heat protectant category. Um, so I use that to help control 
uh, any heat that I'm using just so I don't damage the hair. So I'm using uh, my blow dryer, I'm using my Ergo round brush available on shopfse.com and I'm just working um, that hair up in the air and I know that it's protected. That's the number one thing uh, with these products. So then I go in and I'm gonna use um, the wand iron and that's another aspect of heat. So think about uh, in our daily lives as stylists or as people styling our hair at home, um, you know, you're constantly adding heat to your hair. So you gotta be protecting it. And that's what neuro is all about. So I'm just gonna go through wand through this, grabbing little sections, not fully wrapping it to the end because I want a little bit of looseness to the ends. Um, and then I'll also iron it out at the end as well with a flat iron just to straighten a couple pieces to give it that kind of more lived in beachy look. And then I finished it up with Paul Mitchell Express style uh, worked up. So you can see now I'm straightening out those ends just to give it a little more of a modern touch. And there is our end result, guys. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this look. This is the Paul Mitchell 77C from uh, Color XG Cover Smart, and also this beautiful, simple haircut to go with it. Uh, this is going to be the trend for 2022. What do you guys think? All right, guys. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, hit the bell notification button so that you guys get notified anytime time I make a video and make sure if you haven't done this already to subscribe to whatever channel you are watching this on because I got videos coming out like this all of the time and please let me know what you thought of the video in the comments below uh, anything you have to say I'd love to hear it be sure if you struggle with hair cutting or you're looking to up your hair cutting game then go check out shop FSE which is our online store shop FSE uh, com and you can purchase my digital hair cutting system it comes with eight step-by-step -step haircuts uh, it also comes with a PDF book a certificate for you to hang in your salon when you complete it uh, everything you need to know about haircutting is packed into that haircutting system so go check it out purchase it at shopfse.com thank you guys so much I'll see you on the next video thanks <music>